as a lifelong Rainbow Wahine volleyball fan for I don't know how many years I've probably lost track. You know, I don't know, uh, many of us had actually hoped that maybe this day would never happen, <laughs> but um, I'm really honored to be uh, serving as governor um, during this time. I've uh, had the pleasure of having some of Coach Soji's um, players work in my office as a legislator through the years. I have always been uh, impressed by their commitment and dedication. And truly, I think part of this celebration really is about um, Coach so Soji's legacy of uh, truly believing in the student athlete, assuring that um, all of his students uh, excelled uh, not only on the court, but in the classroom as well. Um, it really is an honor and privilege for me, on behalf of uh, Lieutenant Governor Shan Tsutsui, to proclaim uh, April 13th as uh, Dave Shoji Day yeah. uh, in the state of Hawaii. <laughs> And so it is my honor to introduce the greatest coach in the history of the University of Hawaii athletic program, Dave Shoji. Congratulations, if we have no other introductions, if there are no objections from the members, call for a short recess for the purpose of reading our honored guests. right on the collar and I was able to show him this t-shirt last year. I kept it in my closet. I was 11 years old and I kept it in my closet and I never wore it because that's how much it meant to me. And I still have that t-shirt in my closet today. Um, and it's just a testament to how much you've meant to the entire state of Hawaii, but how many little kids grow up just being inspired by the work that you've done. And so thank you so much and I will keep that t-shirt in there much longer. So Thank you again, and congratulations to both of you, both Coach Shoji and Mary. Thank you. All those in favor, signify by saying aye. aye. The motion is carried. House Resolution 161 is adopted. Representative McKelvey, can you please proceed with the congratulatory certificate and lay? 